Hey fellow world warriors, it's Angry Turtle and in this video I want to figure out if after the latest update I will have better luck and if I can get a good plasma caster. You can see this one in here, that's not a good one, I crafted one earlier on when I was doing the build video for the footage purposes because I like how it looked like but after I crafted one just for the looks I decided that I want a good one as it's a fun gun and I need a new toy for my main. I had a caster on my other account, but not on my main yet. At least not a good one. And I can show you this one. This one is free star, but not a good one. It's a medics then. You know, like medics not the best, <laughs> especially for the heavy gun. Then we want a good one. I have a lot of resources. Hopefully I can get it earlier. I don't know yet because I didn't start crafting then. We'll see. If I if I will be lucky and I will get it super early, then I will try to upgrade a piece of my armor. But first, the plasma caster. As you can see, it requires two legendary modules. I have 164, but no, I'm not gonna use them all trying to craft plasma caster. No, that's not gonna happen. The <laughs> 100 maximum. 100 legendary modules maximum, but let's try to craft like 10 at a time. We have 10 of those and let's see if we have anything good. I can actually switch to modify to see them. Oh, there is bloodied plasma caster with damage while aiming. That's not exactly what I aiming for, but look. How did the game know that I wanted a vampire one? I get three bloodied plasma casters that are good. Especially the Freestar. Have Exterminatures Plasma Caster. Another Medics. Mutants Plasma Caster. Oh, but this one is Vats Hit Chance. That's nice. Nocturnal one. Quad Plasma Caster with less AP cost. Oh, that's interesting one. Any more? Oh, there is Vampire Plasma Caster. The only problem, limb damage. Can I have one with Vats Hit Chance? Okay, those are not the best ones mostly. The quad one is quite cool. It's less AP cost. Let's see if we can get better. I will get rid of some of those first. Okay, I stored them. Let's try to craft another 10. And yes, I'm using Science Expert to reduce the crafting cost. Okay, what do we have? Berserkers, that's not good hunters. Three medics. Oh wow. Three new medics. Another mutant, nocturnal. Two shot, one star, zealots. That was a bad batch. From those 10, there is absolutely nothing good. Okay, there was no more room in my storage and I destroyed those casters. Let's try another 10. One, two. Okay, any better luck? Oh, we have anti-armor, but just one star. Executioners. A lot of limb damage in here. Have junkies with vast hit chance and agility. Why do they want me to use junkies? I really have just like one addiction. Another medics. We have another quad. Should I start using stalkers, plasma casters? Uh, suppressors. Oh, suppressors is with bad hit chance. But apart from that, it's weak. Okay, that's not the best batch. We have just this anti armor and junkies is a good roll. These junkies I need to somehow keep. Okay, let's try one more time. Please give me a good vampire one. Let's try 10 more. Oh, we have free star with us hit chest anti-armor. Ah, we have a good one. Wow, 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 wow. That was close. That was close. I was afraid that there will be like nothing I really want. I'm happy with this anti-armor. That's hit chance. The third star is rubbish, but that's hit chance that what I want. Then we have Berserker, we have Bloodied with Bashing Damage, some Ghoul Slayers with Vats Hit Chance. Another Medics, has a lot of Medics today. Uh, some Mutants, Nocturnal, Stockels Prasma Caster, at least Weightless, and Zealots. Still no good Vampire, but we have really good Anti-Armor. Should I craft one more time? Okay, let's do it. Let's do it one more time, then it will be like 100 modules used. All right, one more time, plasma casters 10. Let's see. 
We have another another anti armor, but this one is bad. Assassins, berserkers, executioners, another junkies, but we already have good junkies, troubleshooters, and we have two shots with bashing damage. Why was it so bad this time? It's all utter rubbish. Okay, I have enough modules to do one more attempt, and it will be more than 100 modules spent. I just need to quickly scrap all those, like, destroy them. One last time. If it will be nothing again, then I will be happy with my anti-armor. Let's see. The moment of truth. We have some berserkers, exterminators, nocturnal. We have quad. Oh, that's another good quad. With Vats hitches. Three stalkers. Wow. Troubleshooters. Two shot. It's a bad one. Zealots. Yeah, I need to be happy with this anti-armor. As uh, this stuff is mostly rubbish, like quad is kind of good. And just before we finish the video, let me see if it's good one. Uh, that's the one we have. I already put prime capacitor and align sniper barrel on it. Uh, let me shoot it a little bit and let me show you if it's good. Uh, I'm on my daily driver build. Let's see the floaters first, then some super mutants. Was it worth it? I spent so many modules. Yeah, the Vats Hitches is halving. I have 95% chance. Oh wow, the sound bug was crazy here. The floaters have this crazy sound bug. And some other weapons have this bug as well. That's crazy. Okay, let's see on super mutants on floaters. I needed to shoot them a couple times to kill. Not too bad. Uh, let's see the super mutant. Oh, that's easy two shots. That's nice. Cannot complain. I think this anti-armor is actually a good choice. Especially that I'm not like 100% spec. Oh, this one died in one. Hello there, super mutants. Where are you going? They almost died in one. If they should be fast, they will probably die in one. Wait, let him hit me. Then he's dying in one. When my taking one for the team is triggered, they are dying in one. Otherwise, I need two shots. But that's apart from that, that's perfect. I could boost it a little bit to, to have a one shot on those super mutants, but I think I'm fine. As taking into consideration how easy it is to get the ammo from daily ops, then I'm probably fine. Probably if I shoot him them twice. The accuracy is the most important part. The accuracy is crazy good. But of course, I'm the herbivore, then I have a lot of perception boost easily available. But look at that. Oh. They just teleported on me. That's cheating. But look at that. Headshots. Easy headshots. 95% hitches. Even from here. Like, oh, from here. Okay, he's looking the other side. That's why. He'll be looking towards me. Look towards me. Look at that. 95%. I can can even go farther away. Oh, now it's dropping. But from this distance, I have almost 95%. That's why I want that hit chance. That's so important. Bye-bye. <laughs> okay, it's perfect. It's perfect. I would probably need a little bit, like, tiny bit more damage to one-shot everything. But I don't need it. I can shoot them twice. That's fine with me. Shooting twice, it's not too much. Then I'm happy with that for, for my daily driver for now. I will have some fun. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, but my luck is definitely not here there. I spent like, I spent like over 100, what, 120 legendary modules. And we get like couple good ones, like one quad, one this anti-armor and vampire was almost good. Then yeah. All right, that will be everything for this video. I hope your luck will be better as this is expensive stuff. This is expensive stuff to craft. And now, as always, thank you a lot for watching and see you guys in the next one.